Texas lakes being taken over by a small creature no bigger than a fingernail. We're talking about these guys, zebra mussels, a small shellfish that's invasive here and reproduces as rapidly as they clog up pipes, harming water quality and killing native plant life. They're native to eastern Europe and Russia and started showing up in Texas lakes in 2009. By 2017, they had infested Lake Travis and quickly made their way further down the Highland Lakes chain to Lake Austin. Some mussels have already been found in Lady Bird Lake and new local environmental groups fear it could turn into a full blown infestation. So they're making a plea to the public saying it's up to us to keep zebra mussels from spreading further. We're all over this tire. A year ago, Capitol Cruises didn't notice any zebra mussels. We definitely notice them now. But now they have to clean them off every single day. If we don't clean off the zebra mussels, it just clogs the air filters and our AC goes very hot. The Colorado River Alliance says other businesses are seeing the same thing. Anybody that's in one of these bodies of water has to know that when they transport water, a wet boat, a wet rope from one water body to another, they could be bringing zebra mussels with them. Brent Lyles says even swimsuits and water shoes can carry tiny baby mussels if they're not cleaned, drained, and dried out properly. He says these mollusks will hurt native wildlife and rack up expensive cleaning fees for property and boat owners. They could also worsen water quality and clog pipes the city uses. Not many people realize that all of Austin's drinking water comes from the Colorado River. Zebra mussels impacting the river could impact our drinking water. With zebra mussel numbers growing faster than expected, Lyle says whether people on the lake clean out their gear now may determine whether other lakes get infested and other boat owners wind up with an unwanted cleanup duty. Alyssa Gord, KXAN News. And in Texas, transporting zebra mussels is a classy misdemeanor. A first time offense can leave you with a fine of up to $500 and repeat offenses can be punished with a fine with as much as $2,000 or jail time of up to 180 days.